In today's video, we're going to learn how to add and edit your signature in the new Microsoft Outlook app. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And if you're in a supercharged way as your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. With that being said, let's get into this. So you can see here that we are in the new Microsoft Outlook app and in the top of right hand corner where we have the X, the maximize and the minimize button, we have our uh, tip notification and then the settings cog. We're going to simply select on the settings cog and this is going to open up our new settings menu. From here, you'll see on the left hand side, you have things like accounts, general, mail, and right under accounts, you have your email, so we can add multiple accounts. And underneath that, you have automatic, automatic replies, and then signature. We're simply gonna select on signature, and then this is where you can edit and create your new signature. So what we're gonna do now is first give this signature a name, and we're gonna call this signature demo, and then simply select on the text box underneath, and you can start creating your signature where I would make sure you add things like your name, your email address, your phone number, and maybe your company website. And then down the bottom, you can see you actually have a range of different ways you can edit your signature. So you can do things like insert pictures if you're to add an image of your company's logo. You could add the format painter to make it look a little bit nicer. You can of course change the font size. You can of course change the font as well as the font size and choose to do some basic things like bold, italicize, and underline. You can add the highlighter and of course the font color, and then you can choose to add bullet points or even number points next to it. And then next to that, on the right hand side, you have the three dots, the ellipses, that give you even more formatting options where you can have a play with these yourself, uh, but this is where you can actually go ahead and change and edit your signature. Underneath that, you have the option of selecting your default signature. So if you had multiple accounts or multiple signatures, you could actually choose a range of different ones, but what we're gonna do for now is simply select on save, and this is going to save that signature. So you can now have the drop down menu and choose which signature you're after. You can rename it, you can edit it, or you can create a brand new signature. But if you only wanna use the one, down the bottom where it says select default signatures, for new messages and for replies, you can drop this down and select on signature demo. And of course, even if you reply or forward an email, you can make sure your signatures are automatically there by simply select on forward and reply, signature demo, and then simply hit save. Now we can X out of this and we can go ahead and we can create a brand new email. And what we'll see here is our signature automatically pops up. If we're gonna forward an email like this one right here, if we select on forward again, that signature that we just created is gonna pop up automatically as well. And there you go, it is that easy to create and edit your signature in the new Microsoft Outlook app. If you like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up and if you want to supercharge ways your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.